these ports here bypass these valves. And now what's that manifold that's at the top? So a manifold is just anything that's a, usually an aluminum, sometimes a steel block that has uh, ports in it. Well, that has some valve in there. It has a uh, what looks to be a counterbalance valve to control the movement and then some relief valves just in case it gets overloaded. What this cylinder is off of is a piece of railroad equipment. So it's like a mobile locomotive where instead of the locomotive just going on rails, it also has wheels. So it can raise and lower the track wheels as it moves from rail line to rail line. So a very powerful piece of equipment. Because we were only repairing this one uh, faulty weld, we didn't look too much into some of the capabilities of the cylinder. We saw that it does have some valves that are in that manifold there, likely a relief valve and, or, uh, and a counterbalance valve. The purpose of a relief valve is, let's say you load the equipment up, it's uh, too much weight, and it would slowly lower as it releases the, the pressure. And then the counterbalance valve would be a way to meter the descent of the cylinder. And how it does that, it does it with pressure as opposed to trying to restrict the flow. So let's say you were trying to shove everybody through a doorway. It doesn't do that by restricting the doorway. It does that by reacting to the pressure that's behind there. 